Hey y'all, it's Lee from Glamp Ride and Thrive, and today I learned three things surprisingly about the National RV Training Academy before I even attend. One is, can you bring your spouse and partner? Two, what tools do you need to attend the National RV Training Academy? That's a big one, so stick around for that one. And my favorite is number three. Where do you stay at and how much does it cost to attend the National RV Training Academy in, as of February 2025? So stay tuned and follow me inside the RV. Let's get into it. Okay, so can you bring your spouse an RV? Well, kind of. The very first week, Tuesday through Friday, you can bring your spouse or partner to a small business class that they teach from 7 a.m. to 8 a.m. Um, additionally, during that first week, there is a free RV kitchen seminar that they can go to as well that kind of teaches the spouses how to utilize the kitchen and stuff like that in a small environment. But other than that, they really can't go unless they pay for the class as well. All right, moving on to number two. The second thing I learned before you start class is what tools you're going to need at the National RV Training Academy. Well, what you're looking at here is my Amazon storefront page, and it's basically everything you need for RVs, day one items, RV gadgets, tools, maintenance, water supplies, etc. But today, we're looking at the National RV Training Academy tool list. And I'll leave links to that in the descriptions as well. So if you open this up, you'll see there's 26 tools that they require you to have for the inspector course and the technician course. If you look at these little quotation marks here, if you click on them, I have it written in here for you guys, required for their RV technician class and the RV inspector class. If you come over here to like this battery charger and click on that quotation mark, this one here is just required for the inspector's class. So if you're only taking one, you're not gonna need everything, but this shows you what you need for each of those courses. Additionally, if you're taking the inspector class, you're also gonna need these kits right here. It is pretty pricey, but it is required. And this one here, again, is for the inspector class, not the technician class. All right. I hope, this, I hope this helps you guys. I almost forgot to tell you guys, you're also going to need one more thing for the inspection class. And that's a Windows-based computer um, or an Apple computer running the parallel software because the home gauge software that they use um, for the inspections does not work with Mac operating system. Um, additionally, you're going to need either an Android phone or an iPhone for the inspection software as well. And I'll leave the links to that as well, the home gauge software, but they recommend to not install the software until you get the class because you'll do it together as a class. So that's the last thing you'll need for the inspection course. All right. So the third thing is my favorite guys. Where do you stay at and how much does it cost to attend the National RV Training Academy as of February 2025. Here we go. Let's jump in. Well, I have the National RV Training Academy website pulled up here, and you can see right here that it's a total of nine weeks if you take all three of these classes. And I'm doing all three of these classes, so that's why I'm going to talk about it. Um, so they have their own Texan RV park and campus on right right next to the facility to be honest with you um it's great for as close as you're going to be you just walk it walk to class every day so that's pretty awesome if you can afford it um and the reason i say that because you can see right here week a week for the cheapest is 282 dollars for the week where i'm staying at is chuck's rv rv resort chuck's rv resort and it's about 11 minutes from the academy and it's paved for their cheapest site. So you can see right here, this is what I'm paying. It's the monthly site. It's $590 plus electric. Now, the Texan Park includes electric. Okay, here I broke down the numbers for you guys. As you can see, if you stay at the National RV Training Academy at the Texas RV Park for the nine weeks, it's going to cost you $2,538 and this includes electric. Now there's nothing wrong with staying there, but it's a little more expensive than what I wanted to pay. And this is on a gravel pad. Now where I'm staying at is Chuck's, it's 590, 590 a month and it's on a concrete slab. So for those nine weeks, you take your 590 times two plus electric. And now I just 
estimated electric being about $250 for the two months that we're here. Um, Cause our RV is usually about a hundred dollars a month. So it might cost you 300. And then for the prorated lat, 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 that last week, the 147.50. So to me, it makes sense for me to pay $1,577 rather than $2,538 plus electric. And Chuck's is right down the road, 11 minutes. Now, what does it cost you to attend the National RV Training Academy as of February 2025? Let's see. Okay, guys, so here's the numbers. Here's my itemized receipt from the National RV Training Academy. As you can see, the total is $10,245.50 as of February 12th, 2025. And this is just for the technician course. I have not paid for the inspector course yet. I haven't got billed yet. Once I get billed, I will tell you about that one as well. But there you go. There's the numbers, guys. Tell me what you think in the comments below. I'll have all the links to all the websites and everything. Please like, subscribe, give me a thumbs up. It helps my channel. I appreciate it. I hope it helped you. Have a wonderful day.